Gray water is wastewater from baths, sinks, washing machines, and dishwashers. While filtered gray water is not potable, it can be recycled for irrigation, flushing toilets, and exterior washing by designing plumbing systems that keep gray water and black water separate from each other. We split off the uh, lavatories, the shower, and the tub uh, in the house, and that those drains don't run into the basic sewer system that is, that is out there, in this case a septic tank. Uh, that we call gray water. The black water, which would be the toilets, and in our particular case, we said the kitchen sink and the uh, uh, washing machine. And those waters were separated out and go into a regular septic tank because of the amount of either chemicals or other bacteria and stuff that would be in them. The gray water that is separated out through the labs and the shower and tub uh, are not stored because even those waters will grow bacteria. Our, our research on this showed that you can start growing bacteria with those waters within 24 hours. So those waters are run through a sand filter, kind of like a swimming pool uh, filter, and then are discharged into a mulch bed, uh, which is a little orchard area. We've got fruit trees planted in the mulch bed, and the water from that simply feeds that mulch bed. When planned into new residential construction, the home's wastewater treatment system can be significantly reduced, resulting in cost and space savings.